Hello guys, what is up? I am the Yep the Plus One and welcome to episode 23 of my Pokemon Crystal Extreme Metronome Randomizer. Last time, with all of Johto Conquer, we headed our way to Kanto, fixed the power plant, and got ourselves two of the eight badges. In this episode, the new session is a new week, and I'm gonna try my best to finish up this game with the last six badges. Of course, not all at once. In this episode, probably maybe two badges, especially as I'm gonna go to the Nugget Bridge and find Misty. If you guys are hyped for more Pokemon Crystal EMR, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe for all content if you're new, and ring that bell to be notified any time below on this channel. The last episode on the card up here. Anyways, no call comes with me at the moment at least, so I will just be hanging around doing some stuff. I hope to not skip too many battles en route to the end of the game, because we are nearing the end, boys. Kanto is not as big as you think, at least it is this game. But I can't say the same for Hard Girl Soul Silver because that one, the Kanto is a lot bigger than it is usually. And you have a hidden power that's already probably said that's fine. Oh dude, bide, really? That's gonna be fun to deal with. Come on. Poison Powder, and you're pretty Poison type or Steel type Electrode, okay. Funny thing enough is that this uh, confusion is actually not uh, the worst thing. In fact, I get no attacking moves as he's biting, that's fine by me. Oh. Lock on, there we go. Oh, great. Okay, good. No, no poison. That's good. And we're already off to a great start, although my self-destruct does hit the Electro at least. And barely doesn't kill him, of course. I did grant a bit of Secret Tendency, though. I'm only level 64. It's one level, former level 65. And that's gonna kill, finally. Off to a smoking start with a self-destruct. Such is the nature of metronome, because of course it is, right? <laughs> but anyways, um, I might as well just take this time to just like say that, man, us, I'm still recording this in 2021 by the time this video comes out. Um, 2022 has been, uh, so 2021 has been absolutely insane. Like, um, I actually just recently put a few of like reflective posts on some of the discords, because honestly, I couldn't think the guys enough for honestly just being with me throughout this, uh, the time that I've been streaming and recording videos. 2021 has been like those years where nothing bad happened so to speak, it's more so just a year of no direction. It was just a year of just like thinking, oh what are you going to do next, not too sure what, what's going to be next in my future. But it's just with the help of others that I honestly enjoyed this experience of just like being a free roamer. Just taking whatever comes my way as what it is and just seeing what lies ahead of me. And honestly, it's just been a great time hanging out with friends, with new friends that I've made throughout these, this year. Yes, there have been some ups and downs, but overall, I can't say that I've had the, a bad time with uh, people. Um, but yeah, that's just been my thoughts recently, especially as I get closer at the time of streaming this. Get closer to the new year, get closer to um, the new job that I have. So, definitely I've been mostly just thinking about, man, what a year it's been. And what is to come? Well, definitely a new job. Um, I can't say more streaming, however, or more recording, because I don't think I'll be able to find too much of the time. As Bubble absolutely destroys in the cargo, as it should. But I definitely will hope to try my best to at least get content for you guys all the more. Try my best to at least deliver something whilst um, I'm out there still making money. Not to say that Twitch has not given me money, no, because uh, I have gotten my pay at one point. But it was more so the idea of just getting an actual paying job. Although that's kind of like, I remember when I was um, 
back in 2017 when I first like did um, university. I remember in 2018 there was a module I was taking which like talked about like planning ahead. I remember very fa- Wow! Lock on fissure! Not that the fissure wouldn't have hit, uh, had a low chance to hit, but that's still pretty funny. That Farfetch had no chance. Anyways, back to what I was saying, um... Not to say that at any, uh, time, I was like, you know, this, oh wait. Ah! Sorry. Not to say that, the. Um, Actually, what am I talking about? Back to the story. Um, I remember that uh, they asked us to plan ahead. At one point, it was like a worksheet. They asked us to like view our future for the next like five years after we finish university. I remember very specifically. I got a paying job alongside my Twitch streaming and all that stuff. And as the years go by, once I make enough money, once I feel so uh, Twitch is paying me good enough, then I'll swap on to Twitch. Now. Considering what happened with Twitch recently this year in particular, it, definitely that idea is not really panning out the way I would expect it. But the fact that I'm getting a paying job in due time is honestly a privilege. I, I can't- I honestly was surprised that I got this as an opportunity myself, and I can't wait for what's to come. Of course by the time I, this has uploaded, I already have I think two weeks of experience, but just the idea of getting that such sort of an opportunity is just bewildering to me. And apparently this Umbra is going to simultoss this Quagsire. Like, hoo Also just saying, if I don't finish it today, I will plan to finish this, um, this seed tomorrow. But, uh, the top of those was, uh, until the streaming and- ooh! Ah, uh, that still does a lot of damage, Bye bye I'm okay with that. I'm number five, I'm gonna stop, yeah. Love oh, this music. My well, something about 16 bit that still uh is ear pleasing now and then. It's always nice to go back to what the tunes that started it all. Oh dear. Raise a leaf. Kind of curious if I'm going to be looking at the spoiler log because once again, Baltier did say that he doesn't have the spoiler log with him at all anymore. Um, what Pokemon would have been suitable in terms of like. But we just kind of mentioned a randomizer. The best case scenario high stats on every single set. Well, Every single stack excluding one of the attacks, and then very low speed. That might be the best scenario, because even though you might be slow moving, you know you can tank almost every hit, excluding of course any uh, Oko moves. And you're able to also dish out damage at the same time. So that's, that's kind of the best case scenario in the Extreme Metronome Randomizer. Because remember, you don't know what the moves are going to be like. And there's that last person that's gonna give us the nugget. Unless for some reason it's randomized, which uh, that's kind of worrying. Chuckle. So then again, I think I'll do like four or five gyms. And then off screen, I'll battle every single person that I skipped. And then grind some more for the final gym. And of course, against Red, because. I'll say this right now, knowing this game has the ex uh, the boosted trainer levels at certain points, I will not be surprised if I'm facing level 100 against Red. Also, that Shuffle got bodied. Black Sire again, okay. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Pain split, of course. Sunny day? Okay. Not that it's gonna affect me too much. Wow! And of course I miss! Uh, I don't know why I switched to Dixie, but uh... 
growth. Uh. Remember, I'm facing at level 40, uh, like 44, so it's not like uh, it's not like I'm like under level by any means. This is gonna be over level central because of uh, what happened earlier. Because I think like the trainers are not uh, boosted up. It's like mostly the main people who are like boosted up. Which definitely is annoyance at times. <laughs> and I still flinch him, nice. Razor win? No, sky attack. Well, I did mention Dixie as the flying shell, so that makes sense. Remember, I taught him fly, for those wondering. Nice. You're kidding! No, I'm not kidding. Give me that nugget. Or not. Ah! Of course. But then again, I did not heal, so maybe he's right. He Maybe he has been waiting for me to be tired out. Politoad? Politoad? Man, Politoad's so weird in this generation. Power to snow. Ah, uh, decent. Barrier. Okay, I don't know why in my head that I thought barrier was spelled wrongly. Ooh. I remember those moments where you thought, look at the word and like, wait a second, that's misspelled, not misspelled, or misspelled, something like that. I remember. It's probably a little bit spoilers, I don't know, second, because that was, um, some of the previous Jack Fox episodes. Actually, well, I'll just put the card up here. Um, I remember like um, one of those episodes, right? I thought I spelled Isaac correctly. I tried to spell it with two S's and not two A's. So, it's one of those moments where it's like, wait, I thought I spelled it correctly. No, I definitely did not. Also, that is very sad to look at. Very kind of, that's gonna kill. Super Nerd Norath. If I heard you're watching, I'm so sorry. And now you're gonna give me the nugget. Thank you very much. And now you do one more battle. And I will see what that item's on top. Oh, 57. Ooh. Slightly more stronger people here. Gus. <sighs> Will I dare make a compilation of like the spoiler log technically? Uh, no, I wouldn't. But it would it be nice to know like uh, what stats these guys would have had, or the Pokemon would have had. Honestly, considering the idea. Also, Wiggly Tree is back. <laughs> huh? File throw. Ba -da -da -ba -da. Okay. So not only do I have high special defense, I also have uh, high defense and attack. Nice. Ooh. It's not gonna matter though. Nope. Although I do get burned. And nope, of course not. Ugh, that burn actually did a lot more than I wanted to. I thought I had a full heal. Oh, there, there it is. Apparently I also did not have, um... Any berries that would have helped that for that, apparently. I still have my lumber- uh, lumberries? Excuse me. I still have my mystery berries, uh... Uh, though, which is funny. Again, okay, everybody's just doing one damage! Uh, the slowest fight. Freeze, let's go! Shadow Ball. I have actually got to post all of my... I think for those who are following me on Twitter, I've been posting a lot of like my highlights from playing games like Pokemon, WDSP, Mario Party Superstars, all that stuff. Um, I do plan to put some of them up to, um... 
I do plan to put some of them up to YouTube as shorts, like some highlights I've had. So uh, stay tuned for that. Such a thing. Splash, of course. Ah, what better way to continue on your run with Splash? And now he's wrapped me. Great. Fun. Come on. Oh dear. Can I please have a move? Fine. Well, at least you didn't put a move either. And for those wondering what I'm looking at, let's just say I'm multitasking, uh, playing. Don't question. How's that not yellow hell? What? Weird. Oh, so yeah, I'm aware that, uh, my, uh, Chloe says, I'm gonna die. Oh, a lot of that was, um, explosion or something like that. Five hits, not bad. Although this Tsunami's gonna, uh, die unless he misses Bide. I know Bide can miss, but I think it was only until Gen 5, uh, until Gen 5 which it was able to miss because it's a ghost Pokemon. I still remember that one hilarious moment when I watched a video, I think it was uh, United Gamer, when um, he tried strategizing against a Biting Mudkip, because he did use Bide, and he swapped into his Ghastly just to ensure the hit move didn't hit, it still hit. Even though it was a ghost type he was up against. It was quite hilarious. That might kill, hopefully. There we go. And I survived against the Nugga Bridge, uh, boys and girls. Alright, now let's firstly get this item and then we'll finally, finally, or so, finally be able to see where, uh, Misty. Art. Hi, Misty. Hey, must be good. I'm happy to take you on. Lucky she goes the long way, not the easy way. I'll just take my bike all the way home. And again, home would have been North Bark Towns, which is not where I want to go, for ex uh, I wouldn't say that those guys were tough by any means, but they definitely put up a strong fight, to say the least. And once again, as I said before, I'm not planning to battle everyone. It's more so just the idea of um, taking them on, uh, taking on the gym leader in, in specifically. I think the one battle I'm curious about, however, is against uh, my rival later on. Uh, let's battle you, Glob. Rubber the Glob, Glob. Porygon two, fun. Plus, remember that all these guys are high level, so they are forced to evolve. So you will see like Porygon 2s, Tyranitars, all that stuff. Question is, can I handle against them? Not bad. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like the poison, the toxic poison, is less effective than regular poison in Gen 2. I know Gen 1 it was worse case, but. I remember it was just like, I was just looking at the poison like bar, whenever he's normal poison, and it seems to go a lot faster compared to toxic poison. Or maybe I'm just that impatient. Who knows? It might be, it might be the latter. And that's gonna do 65 damage. It's like as though I'm a sidekick. Oh. Oh, oh boy. That two damage! Fun. Two, three hits, okay. I thought I was gonna go for five. Okay, at least I hit. 
Also, I'd like to point out, that's the second time my Zapdos exploded. Actually, not thinking about it, wasn't it the first time also by a self-destruct? Ah, oh, I ducked on it. Also, I like how my Megzi, uh, Umbreon uses Pursuit. How fitting. Giraffe Rex, staying in. Wow. Come on. Come on. Come on. You know you want that. There we go. <laughs> Always the most satisfying thing when you see the bar go all the way down. And now let's uh, battle you next, and then Misty is next, and I'll just heal up. Uh, another Porygon, too. Okay. That's another solar beam. Ugh. Come on. Stop going. Another five hit there. Five hits, including a crit. Ah. Oh, it's frustrating when you see that. I waited all this long for that, and oh, great. Okay, good. At least that one only hit twice. I will take that. Especially if the fact that uh, there's only one Pokemon that she has. Double Kick. Not so, Double Kick is also very strong, apparently. Now that is satisfying. Metal Claw. There we go. I should just realized, did I use Metal Claw on the other Porygon too that she had? <laughs> Man, I'm experiencing Deja Vu everywhere, apparently. Uh, you know what? I probably won't be using this Revise anytime soon until the very end, so let me just use this. And uh, Hyper Potion for good measure. I did actually swap my speed up button, for those wondering. Just to experiment. Alright, let's battle you, Misty. Ah, you say water type Pokemon, but they probably are not, Misty. Misty, we that. Case in point, unless you tell me you are a water type, which would be funny. Okay, sure, Macham. Oh! Machamp is a ghost type! Interesting, okay. Heh, <laughs> why not? Man, it's been a while since I've seen that sprite. Good thing I can escape with that and totally neutralize that. Very swipe is special. Flash and uh, of course. And yep. I remember Sir was very strong, that's why I'm like, yep. Of course. Blank over. That flamethrower sprite kind of looked like the hot road jump, um, flame of uh, uh, rope, uh, from like Mar Party. It kind of looks like it. A palm. And a tsunami. Man, I forgot that cry of A palm is so uh, awkward. I just hear it. So I was like, man, that doesn't sound like a Pokemon I would know of. And oh dear. A pop with a hat. Any mystery swipes. That's fine. Very cutter. 
Eh. I only have five uh, power points as well, so I remember that. I'll be struggling in due time. Oh, great. Okay. Getting a little concerned there. And I miss extreme speed. Fun. And... Oh, wait. He missed extreme speed. I hit glare. Never mind. I saw wrongly. And... Oh, yeah. King's Rock. <laughs> I was just thinking to myself, wait a second. I'm pretty sure Jump Shade does not supposed to flinch. I just remember the hell item I have. And I don't even need to struggle. Nice. Didn't even need to struggle. Shuckle. Uh, let's get Witchy up to level 65. About time he did. Level 66 Shuckle. Sludge. Oh dear. Then poison at least. Boomerang. Eh, decent. Can't say that's the worst damage. Oh, of course. I mean, just see me through, man. I, I don't mind that. Frustration. To fall asleep. Strength. I wake up to do Bubble Beam. Very tame move. Sure. Ah, I feel the lightning and the thunder. Bam! And that was a crit too, I'll take it. And last Pokemon is another Cloyster, level 68? 71! Uh, yo, yo, you wanna do back-to-back -back, uh, Oko moves? I wanna mine. Thunder Punch. Come on, not an Oko move. White screen. Talk on it. Ah, uh, gotta have my cake and eat it, unfortunately. And that is gonna be a kill, unfortunately. That was 105 damage for those who were forgotten. Okay, I transform into the. Oh, that is funny. I am a I'm a cloister, and I transform into the other cloister. Fun. Rain dance. Ah! <laughs> Really? <laughs> the two most pointless um transforms I've ever seen in my life. Oh my goodness. Oh dear. Fine, actually that works. Now if only it was clam, that would have made it even funnier. Okay, or you could just constrict me and make it even worse. Bum -ba -da. Bum -ba -da -da. That's been fell. Come on. Future side. That's fine. As long as I'm able to do something against this thing. Uh, that's like 5% for time and... Okay, what is with these repetitive moves? That's not gonna hurt me too much, that's just half my HP. Although it does give me the excuse... ...to use this. About as slow as, uh, Blissey. Fury Cutter. And there's a Future Sight. Uh, that's decent. I already down to half health, that's quite good. As long as my opponent doesn't uh, do something dumb. And one more metronome. Aeroblast. One of mine, come on. Man. Literally doing zilch. Wow. Had little damage because of how bulky Cloyster is.
Oh dear. Uh, the ever existent struggle. My goodness, this is gonna take a bit. I. I flinched with struggle! Oh, that's hilarious. Never thought I'll see struggle flinch. But today was the day. Let me just speed this up. Oh boy. And I don't know why I did that. And yeah. Well. Oh, come on. I self destruct to win. How fitting. And give me the Cascade badge, because boy, that was a train wreck. Badge number 11. Oh, that was a train wreck and a half, but we got through it at least. Alright, now I wonder what we'll do next, because that's three badges down. area I could get except Saffron, I guess. But Saffron I already got. Vermilion already got... I guess Celadon is my next goal then. Because it's right next to us. Um... Yeah, I got rid of Fly on you. Uh... Yeah, we'll go to Celadon. Then my next uh, stage is just going backwards, all that stuff. Uh... Yeah, left. To the left, to the left. Yeah, from here on I'll probably will speed up now and then because uh, I don't want to take too long. Also, I can figure something. Actually, um, okay, I think I know what I will do. As I head up to get some stuff, actually, for the bike. Why am I just walking like a chum? There. Is, are you still going to be an Eevee? I forgot what this person does now. Hello. Uh, oh no, you're just uh, the scary thing at night. I probably will do that off screen. Man, the weird stuff that these uh, things uh, do back in the days. There's the other game corner. <laughs> I'm just supposed to, there's nothing. I'm back when the days when there was the thing right there. But hey, if we were talking about that, we're playing the wrong game. Ah, uh, was the guy on the other side, I think? Nothing about it. Yeah, these are all slot machines, I remember. So, what was this here? Yeah, just all these are the TMs, and this one is... Hit one top, rat attack, wolfish. Okay. Sure. Alright, let's do it. Gonna find the fastest route to, uh, facing, uh, Erica. And it all starts with these girls. But although it looks as though I can't actually go straight to her straight away. So that might take a bit. Unsexy. Ah, uh, again! That just feels so weird. Oh dear. Does Sapphire have a belly? Well, then again, uh, every Pokemon will be able to eat, so the answer is yes. Mirror Moon failed. Well, Rana, of course I miss. Oh my goodness, really? Can't, can't take a bunch of plus six attack if I keep missing, right? There we go. Unless that's special. Ah, uh, that beat looks like a physical move, and that's going to kill. And now with the other one, that 
Okay, so get to Dojo. So party your own birds. Well, quote unquote birds. Healing. As you can totally tell, you as I anticipate every move, it's like I don't really pay too much attention to the moves. Bye bye! And Witchy's final level 65. No more of that self-destruct nonsense. Also, I did notice that his defense is 240. That is absolutely insane. Can I battle... Uh, sorry, skip the other girl. That's the question I have. Hitmonchan. I guess another question is, am I actually going to, um... Am I actually going to uh, miss... No. Am I actually going to find all 251 Pokémon in this game? Because there are still some which I, um, skipped over slash, um, have not seen. I still can't believe it, though. Like, the mid-stage of some starter Pokémon, and then Caterpie, Weedle, and Kakuna. Or Metapod, excuse me. All of those I have not seen in all this game. I still can't believe that. Come on, come on. Ah. Was hoping. Sludge, and of course I miss. Psych up. Okay. So much going on there. I need to hope for it so I'm not a move. Come on. Come on, slap. Okay, good. As long as it kills, I don't care if it's ineffective, as long as it kills. Because the last thing you want to do is get stuck on red health for so long. Also, I can skip her. Were you looking at those flowers or me? Uh, probably the flowers. I'm a very modest man. I have zero clue why I said that. Uh... I guess now you know. Anyways. Uh... Oh boy. Okay, good. At least it doesn't hurt too much. Really? Man, it's always been five or three so far, or two. No four. And I mean that for realsies. Oh dear, another biting Pokemon, of course. And I already hit him straight away. Fun. Ooh, I hit him for quite a bit of damage too, which is the other worrying part. I hit him again. Oh dear, and that was a crit too. I mean, if he misses? Question mark? No, he's not gonna miss Bide. See? Why would he miss Bide at any point of time? Besides, if he missed Bide, it wasn't a Bide to the rules of Pokémon. Okay, I'll stop. Ah. Uh, thank you. As long as it kills. I mean, this controller really has served me well this year as well. Um, I made the investment, and honestly, it's paid off dividends in so many ways. I really enjoy this controller. Also, at least it allows me to get used to a controller, because I think as I said when I first bought it, I've never actually held an Xbox controller or PS4 controller until a few years ago when I first played uh, Sonic Unleashed with my friend over at his place. I remember I felt so weird holding a controller like this, but now this Xbox One controller feels a lot better, honestly. And that was a crit too, I'll take it. And the last one's a ferret. Ah yes, the meme the meme Pokemon. 
go back. Although, we could say that Furret, who has been on the escalator for so long, can finally take a rest. Uh, I, I remember seeing that video, and I was just like, man, they are really hoping. And then of course, BDSP finally comes out, and honestly, now we can actually say that that Furret can finally take a break from walking. Also, that's a very good burn. Man, again, it's either 2, 3, or 5 thus far. I haven't seen a single 4 yet. There's no 4, but it's a 1 of 4. I can say I was gonna stop. <laughs> ah, I can't help it. Ah. We got through We got through it, though. We got through it, though. Alright. Let me revive, and we'll see what uh, Erica has for us. Man, whenever it's like low health, apparently the Pokemon at least heal up faster. It seems like if it was to be a lot higher health, the health goes up a lot slower than earlier. I don't know, maybe it was just me. Alright, let's do Erica, then this will be the end of this episode. I need to take a break and then now I need to set up some stuff. Especially with the weather again. Well, the weather I just seen dark clouds overhead. Oh dear. And of course it's a crit. In the words of that one penguin, it's a crit! Sonic Boom, deal me that 65 damage! Uh oh. Oh boy. Stop, stop, please, no, 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 why, no, why, why, why? Oh god, it's of course. Well, another excuse to use the max potion, I guess. That gummit. Better not use cross up again. Mean look, that might be worse. Also, oh dear, I forgot how scary mean look is in this game. One thing I also noticed, by the way, this is gonna be the one time you see Vital uh throw um Oh shoot! Oh bomber, of course. That's like man, that's dirty. That is dirty. Uh he mean look me and now he leads to me, because of course he's that smart. Another shot. Okay, I killed it. Good! Good! Get rid of the, the octobus. Typhlosion. That's gonna be fun to deal with. E. I almost actually pulled up my controller and made it fa uh, fall. That would've been very bad. That's an armor. Eh. That's actually pretty good. Frustration, doesn't affect. Oh! Yes! Got it! And that was a crit too. Uh, Lugia! Yeah, finally! Uh, how long has it been since we've seen a legendary? Oh boy, what level are you? Level 69, of course. Done Spore, it's fine by me. And of course I get four less on the first turn. Oh dear, that is problematic. Oh dear, that is gonna be so problematic. Vice Grip, Rock Smash, I do hit it. Yeah, lower its defense. Oh my god, I'm fully paralyzed again. I'm fully paralyzed again! I missed again! I psyched up. Great. I lost my thing. Uh oh, let's full store. Razor win. Uh, scary face. Can I stop? Missing! Low kick. I get paralyzed again! I speed almost kills. I get. Done again, and oh my god, it's hyper potion. 
I keep missing a Paris song. That's awkward. Absor- Oh my goodness. Uh, bubble Beam. Uh, let's both switch out at the same time. Unless he decides not to, which I'll be surprised. But at least it gets rid of a Minimize anyways. He did not switch out. I'm okay with that. Get rid of the Lugia, please. And the last one's a Dark Trio. Surprised that Pokemon I still don't have a VDSP. And it's also level 69, okay. Uh, nope. Of course not. Nope. All the ineffective moves, because of course. Oh. Come on, it's a bit more. Ah! At least got the Paralyze on it, which is a, th a statement I never thought I would say on the Dugtrio, but then again, Stun Spore does exist. On rush. Oh. Come on! Ah! Still not a f no four-headed so far, which I'm still surprised that's the case. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, of course it hits three times! Thanks, game. Really appreciate that. Really do appreciate that game. Hi. Body slam, and of course I miss. Another shot. And there we go. Hi. Got the red at least, and that's two more gyms down. And of course, it gives me 6,900 uh, bucks. Thank you for the money. And we get one more metronome. One of the few um, Kanto gym leaders that give us a metronome in crystal. Oh my goodness. Well, at least we got through it. But at least we got through it. And let's just move away from that guy. He's apparently, he likes girls. Even though he's too old. <laughs> Da, 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 we are rolling through Making clean work off these gym leaders right now Alright, so that's four gym leaders now. I don't think I can see it from here, can I? Yeah, no, I can't see that. It's mostly just the, uh... Mostly just the other uh, things. Uh, you know what? I just realized, hang on. Let's head into the apartment store before we end off. Let's see what items they have. Well, I got more of this at least, so let me spend on those. I don't really need those anymore. Uh, where's my... Nugget. No upstairs, there's not really much. I don't think the girl also gives me anything, I'm not mistaken. At least in this game. Uh, is there a Solex here? Yes, there is. No, okay. Just want to confirm that. Let me just go up here first, however, and uh, see what's up here. Yeah, you're not much. Not much to say about this guy, because he's boring. You know what, let me see what's encounter here, why not? It's been a while since we've gotten an actual encounter, because I've just been focusing more on trainers. So I'm not surprised they've just been skipping all these, and hi, Nino Queen! Eh, yeah, I don't really care about you, unfortunately. Eh, really, Norath? Really? Thanks. I think um, I'm gonna take a quick break, and then next time, uh, once I come back, I will um, take care of the next few gyms I'm gonna do. I'm probably gonna start with Fuchsia, just to take the cycling road down, so I'll be right back.